Hello students, my name is Arva and my channel name is Arva and Physics. Students, please don't forget to subscribe my channel. It just be very motivating for me to upload more and more good videos, very intuitive concepts for you. Uh, and the benefit will of course goes to you also. So please, please, please don't forget to subscribe. Uh, for let's uh, this is question number I think fifth according to my series and this question is if a beam of red light and a beam of violet light are incident at some and at same angle on the inclined surface of a prism from air medium and produces angle of refraction R and V respectively which one of the following is correct okay so this is the question from sample paper class 10th CBC board okay students I want to tell you first let's uh, just draw the figure for it look carefully this is my let's say this is my prism one surface okay and I have inclined what they have said if a red and violet beam of violet light are incident at the same angle same angle means at this point they have incident red light and beam of violet light at the same angle okay uh, let's draw a normal for the reference let's draw normal look this is normal is always perpendicular to the surface and this is norm this is look this is perpendicular okay 90 degree can you see this is 90 degree I'm not drawing it because my figure is going to mess up so surface perpendicular okay at the same angle this is my red also and this is my violet light also so this is my angle of incidence i okay as you know as you know if inside the prism inside the prism look what happens here uh, let me just extend this incident line what does it mean? It means many of you have this concept, this concept in your class that if this prism was not there, this light would like to go straight, correct? Since because of the prism and air, if this is air, they have said one medium is air, correct? Air is medium. So air to this medium. Light goes from rare to denser medium always bend towards the normal. So it has two rays. One is red and one is violet. Students, violet color has refractive index. Violet color has refractive index 1.532. And red color has refractive index is equals to 1.513. Which has higher refractive index? This one. As both. Hai na? So, higher refractive index, higher as compared to this. This is lower. Okay, both compare. And yesterday video in what I uploaded yesterday, I told you if you have higher refractive index, it means light will bend more towards the normal. Correct? Light will bend more towards the normal. So, in this, violet will bend more towards the normal. Look, violet will bend more towards the normal. Correct? And what about the red? Red has lower refractive index as compared to violet. So it will not bend more but it will bend less towards the normal. This is red and this is violet. Correct? Now what is angle of refraction? This is angle of refraction for red that is they have denoted by R. So let's say this is angle R. And this one is, this one is uh, with the normal okay always uh, remember angle always makes with the normal so this is your angle r okay and this will be your angle v angle v means um, violet normal always makes angle with the normal don't forget this concept okay so this is my red light and this is my normal this is my violet light and this is my normal okay so normal makes with the refraction angle v normal makes with the red light angle r okay now you can easily see angle r is greater than angle v okay so students correct option is b angle r is greater than angle v now i will tell you one more very interesting thing here many of you have confused this that red bends more 
सॉरी रेड बेंड्स लेस सो इट मस्ट हैव लेस डेविएशन एंड वॉलेट बेंड्स मोर सो इट हैज मोर डेवी स्टूडेंट दैट इज एंगल ऑफ डेविएशन इफ यू आर टॉकिंग टू मी लेट से दिस इज माई नॉर्मल एंड दिस इज माई नॉर्मल सो लेट से दिस इज माई रेड लाइट एंड दिस इज माई वॉलेट लाइट दिस इज माई रेड एंड दिस इज माई वॉलेट सो इफ यू एक्सटेंड दिस दिस इज एंगल ऑफ डेविएशन फॉर रेड and this is angle of deviation this is angle of deviation for violet okay so deviation of violet deviation of violet look deviated from in what do you mean by angle of deviation that how much light is deviated from its original path so violet is deviated more from its original path as compared to red look red deviates less this is delta r so delta r is less for uh, violet light is more deviated as compared to red light so students don't can confuse don't tick this uh, d option why because they have asked about angle of refraction they have not asked about angle of deviation okay so hope you got the concept clearly and keep watching don't forget to subscribe and share my video thank you so much khuda hafiz mm -hmm.